Hi everybody, my name's Eamon and today I'm going to walk you through how you can start sending mail today directly from the Lob platform. So I'm going to start by navigating to the Lob dashboard, which is the homepage you see when you log into Lob. And on the left hand side here, you'll see the option to create a campaign. So I'm going to click to create that campaign. I'm going to give it a name and a description here, and I'm going to click on Start Building. So this brings us to a simple four-step workflow that enables us to quickly and easily uh, generate a mail campaign with only two inputs, a CSV list of our target audience and the creative that we want to send to everybody in that list. And one thing to note before I go further is that you can still integrate with Lob directly via our APIs or connect Lob directly to your CDP, CRM, marketing automation tools, etc. Um, so you still have those options available for automating mail, but this tool is really an easy way to start sending mail with no integration required um, as soon as you sign up with Lob. So first I'm going to select my campaign type. I'm going to select marketing, uh, but as you can see, Lob supports operational use cases as well. Next, I'll select my mail type. So I'm going to leave this set to postcard, but you can also choose letters. Today, via our API, you can send additional formats like self-mailers. Um, those are going to be coming to this platform soon, so stay tuned. Choose my postcard size, um, postage preferences. So for example, I can include an optional return address. I can choose whether I want to send this first class or standard class. And then finally, we have this cancellation window. So Lob mail is generated on demand, and you can think about it similarly to how you think about an email. Whether you're triggering one mail piece or a million mail pieces, Lob is going to start the process of passing those to print partners to be produced and mailed as soon as this cancellation window elapses. So you can use this to you know, buy yourself a little time before that production process begins. Finally, you can add metadata tags to your campaign. So these can be, for example, something like your own campaign ID. This way, when you get data back from Lob, um, you'll get to see information in your own terms. Next, I'm going to add my target audience. So this is going to be simply bringing in a CSV audience list that looks something like this. It's going to contain the name and address of everybody that I would like to send a mail piece to. And then I can choose to include additional fields for things like dynamic fields within my creative itself. So for example, if Larry Lobster's postcard is going to say, hi, Larry, I might have a merge variable called name that gets replaced with Larry on his postcard. Um, or to apply those metadata tags at the individual mail piece level. So for example, associating your own customer ID with that customer's individual mail piece. But once I have that audience list set up, all I have to do is drag that into the Lob platform and then go ahead and click Next. And this is where I will bring in my creative. So with Lob, you have two types of creatives available to you. Um, the first one are PDFs. So these are great for static creative that's going to be the same for everybody you're sending to. And you can drag those into Lob by just bringing them off your desktop into the platform. And you'll see that you'll get a preview of that here. Or if you're going to send personalized or dynamic mail, you're going to design that in HTML. And you'll save that HTML template within Lob, which will then be available for you to select here. That brings us to the final step, which is just reviewing our campaign setup. Um, so here we're just going to ensure that we've selected the right audience, that our creative looks the way that we expect it to look. And if everything looks good, we're gonna go ahead and click on place order. And this is going to start the process of generating mail for everybody in our audience list. And now you're done. That campaign has been scheduled and Lob is already starting the process of producing those mail pieces and getting everything on its way. So hopefully that was a helpful example of how you can easily send personalized mail with Lob. If you have any questions or if you'd like to see more, please feel free to connect with Lob today to set up a discussion to learn exactly how Lob can make sending mail easier and more effective for you than ever before. Thank you.